Well, grace and peace to you. This is Reverend Jerron Singley, St. Stephen Baptist Church. Um, just wanted to give you an update on the um, Romans project that we're working on. I know a number of you have been um, calling me and hitting me up, um, getting at me, letting me know that um, when's the next installment coming out. Well, some of you I was able to talk to in person, but the others of you that are checking this out on um, YouTube or on Facebook, um, at the beginning of Lent, which was Ash Wednesday, um, about three weeks ago, our pastor put out a challenge to us to read through the Bible completely um, during this Lent period. So we had these roughly 46 days that we were to get through all 66 books of the Bible, and that's been quite a challenge. I know a lot of people have been reading like an hour, two hours or so a day, some people more than that. And so um, I kind of tailored off the project a little bit just to allow time for people to do that reading and to focus on that so we can kind of work through that as a body. And also, um, I'm pouring myself into that as well. I'd already started a project of reading the Bible through in a year. And um, when the pastor announced this, I just started all over again and, and, and jumped right back so I could be in tune with the, with the whole body here at St. Stephen. So the next installment of Romans, um, finishing off Romans chapter 1, be sure to look for that right after Easter time. I mean, uh, so about three weeks from now. Um, expect to see that one, and then we'll keep tracking. We'll just keep flowing with it. So um, expect to see that in a few weeks. But until then, for those of you who are um, reading your Bible every day, I encourage you to do it, to stay in it. Even if you don't have, you know, two hours a day, put in an hour. If you don't have an hour, put in a half hour. And I think the main point of Pastor's Challenge is that when we get through it all, we will all probably have read more uh, than we had before. So that's the key. So anyway, Romans, um, look forward to coming soon. God bless you. I'll talk to you later.